this temperature and this engine load, you just connect the dots. Basically, the top row of this table is where we are wide open when the turbo comes up. Uh -huh. But we're not running down here. We're running the car fully warmed up. We're going to be right through here, 150 degrees to 180, basically. Uh -huh. So, and at that load, you know, we're going past that because we're turbocharged, but this basically means that that's what we call lambda. Mm -hmm. And 1.0 lambda is stoic air fuel, where you got an even burn. And that's where you run idle, hard throttle, light acceleration, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. So there's lambda one right there. That's your cruise, which, you know, for 100% pump gas, mm -hmm. about 14.6, 14.7 air fuel. Mm -hmm. So if you take 14.7 and multiply it times 796, we're looking for an 1170 air fuel. That's what it's calling for. Okay. Okay, and that's a reference. Uh -huh. This is what we want. That's the target. Now you saw we weren't getting that up here. Right. We got a 1219, about a 1220. 1230 right there so we're a little bit lean there only because we're calling for this 1170 uh -huh. so you don't dick with that because that's your reference what you do is you go over to your mass airflow meter which is this guy and where you are in that airflow function the volts coming out uh -huh. this count that's the volts coming out of the meter that's the airflow that's correlated to that voltage by the computer and you got it by pound mass tick, which is the PCM's way of looking at it. And you've got our way of looking at it, which is pounds per minute of airflow. The mass of air, the weight of the air. Uh -huh. That's so, yeah, I see 75 up there. If you got, you know, say you got 45 pounds of air, uh -huh. but you're commanding 11.7, you're getting to 12.3. 12.3 divided by 11.7, you add 5% onto that 45 pounds per minute. And now it's going to be 47.3 pounds per minute you call for there. Uh -huh. And when you tell it it's got more air coming in, it will assign more fuel. Uh -huh. You don't actually tell it you want more fuel. You tell it there's more air, so you need to give me more fuel. Oh, uh, okay. That's cool. So yeah, it's, it's neat. It's, 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 it's telling the brain, it's, in other words, it's teaching the brain to send more fuel when more air Exactly. And, and you're, you're not fooling it. You're, uh -huh. you're, you're recalibrating it. You're uh -huh. changing that curve.